What is good you guys? It's Christmas time and it's time for a little vlog and a little update because one of the guys that I've been watching recently that's kind of influenced me a little bit has just been detained and I'm kind of upset about it because he seems a decent guy and that media is just out to get him. I don't know what's up with it and I don't know why they've arrested him and his brother but I think he's innocent, you know, unless there's solid proof the guy's going to be released, his brother's going to be released, everything's going to be okay. But there's no need for the media to do what they do. Just because people speak out about things doesn't mean you can come and arrest them. You know, people are entitled to opinion. It's called freedom of speech for a reason. You're, you're free to speak. You're a human being. You're allowed to have freedom of speech. Regardless of whatever happens to them both, I hope they both get out okay. Hope nothing happens to them. Remember that one of them said they'd never kill themselves. They're not suicidal. They're never going to do this. They're never going to do that. It's because they're not. You know, so I hope Andrew and his brother get out of this because there's no need for what's going on. So, yeah, I hope Andrew and Tristan get out of this. OK, because there's no need for the media to jump in and arrest them like this. It's been plotted what's happened to them both. I guarantee. And if the next thing that comes out that Andrew Tate's dead or Tristan Tate's dead, then it's been something conspired by the CIA, vice versa. And I'm going to say it on my channel because I'm not scared, guys, you know. You know how we are on this channel. We tell the truth. We say it as it is. And, you know, when people are conspiring, I'm not against conspiracy. I don't care about that shit. I don't give a fuck. People can do what they like, you know. If people want to do whatever they want to do in life to get by, they can do that. But... I believe that these two guys are innocent, regardless of anything. And I've been ill over Christmas, really ill. I don't know if you can tell in my voice. I can barely hear myself speaking. I'm that deaf. But the two guys that have been arrested, Andrew Tate and Tristan Tate, it's, it's unfair. They've been detained in Romania. They're going to be questioned for traffic allegations, vice versa. But without any evidence or anything like that, they're going to get released. And all I'll say to you two guys... You've inspired me. I've been watching your guys' shorts for quite a while now. And I've got to restart my life. Currently, guys, I'm going under the process of being made redundant at work. And that doesn't mean that I'm a shit employee. I've been shit at my job. I've been shit at what I do. That is just that my role at work has become redundant. I've become surplus to requirements. That's all that means. Sorry for spitting there. I've just become surplus to requirements. And that's all that means. So what I'm going to do... Rather than going and finding another job, I'm just going to do what these guys have shown me. I'm going to become my own boss. And that's what I'm going to do with my YouTube, with my next career. Stay tuned for future updates because Moonag and Jande are coming to the channel. I've just been a bit ill this Christmas. I've not enjoyed the Christmas at all because I've had like tonsillitis, laryngitis and the flu all in one. It's been ridiculous. My sister came and spoke to me on like the 23rd or 24th of December. I can't even remember because I was that out of it. And I kind of lost my rag with her. So, Kelly, I apologise to you. I'm sorry for the way I spoke to you. I didn't mean it. Yes, I've had a few beers. But it's not just because I've had a few beers. But it's the meaning of this vlog was tonight, guys. was basically just to basically talk about Andrew Tate and Tristan Tate. Um, but I'm going into my own vlog now. So, what I wanted to say was... Oh, get my finger out of the way. But, um, yeah, like I was saying, I've had tonsillitis, laryngitis, and I've had a bit of the flu as well over Christmas. I've not enjoyed Christmas. I've not spoke to anybody in about eight, nine days, even my own mother. I apologise to her. It's not her fault. It's not, a, not anybody's fault. But the reason for this vlog tonight was literally just to come down and say, I hope Andrew Tate and Tristan Tate get out of being arrested free because they're innocent. They've not done anything wrong. All they've done, like everybody else has done in the world, is had free speech, spoke their mind, and been arrested for it. It's, it's the same like, you know, a traffic stop. You know, if you mouth the officer back, he gives you like a warning. Like if you carry on, you're going down to the jail, blah, 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 you're going to prison. Well, arrest me then. That's all I'd say to that. Well, arrest me then. What have I done? Show me what criminal activity I've done. Arrest me and tell me what I've done wrong. Because, in my eyes, all these guys have done 
they speak their minds, they've done whatever business they've done to make their money, they're into whatever they're into, crypto, whatever they're doing, making their money, minding their own business, and people hate on that, the fact that they've come from backgrounds like myself, low living background, low, low earning, low cost, I'm not even middle class, I'm like lower class, but they come from backgrounds like myself, and they're getting arrested because they speak their mind. It's disgusting. And Aiden Ross, if you ever come across this video, mate, bail your boys out because you've got more money than I've got. But support brothers, you know. I like what you do. I like what Andrew Tate does. I like what his brother Tristan does. And I like Luke as well, their cousin. You know, I like what all you guys do. Not just because I'm trying to jump on a bandwagon, but it's literally because people are allowed to speak. Free speech is out there. It's one of our amendments. You know, you've got the Fifth Amendment. We've got freedom of speech from the United Kingdom. It's one of those things. People can't take that away from us. You can say whatever you like. All right, activity, criminal activity shouldn't be accepted. No, but I don't believe that these guys have done anything wrong. All they've done is speak their mind and been arrested because they've spoken their minds. And this is the thing. The last couple of years, I've minded my own business. Never, ever bothered with anybody. But all of a sudden, Andrew Tate popped on my timeline one, one time. I viewed one of his videos and I thought, what a prick. I literally thought the first time, what a prick. But then I subscribed to a channel with Andrew Tate on it. I think it's his channel or one of his channels. And it's inspired me so much just watching some of his videos because it just teaches you to cut the shit out of your life. Literally, there's so much shit in your life that you bother about. Like nothing. There's, there's things out there like, you know, people's opinions. Don't even waste your energy on that. Don't waste your time. Don't even breathe the same air as that person. Because the amount of time you spend thinking about what that person's just said to you over nothing. What's the point? Literally, what is the point? You know, you're going to waste energy and time over someone's opinion. Something that's not even valid. And yes, on Kid Ginger Vlogs, we drink beer, we have a laugh, we're a family here, we're a brand, we're growing. But more importantly, this vlog, I just hope Andrew and Tristan come out okay from all this. It's ridiculous what authorities can do because they think they have power. I'm not scared of police, you know. There's things in my background people don't know. But I'm not bothered. It's going to get found out. Information is going to get told. And I'm not bothered. End of the day. I am who I am. I love my family. I've got a daughter. I've got an ex-missus. Who's the mother of that daughter that I love as well. I've got a girl in America that I love. But you know what? I can't choose. But... We're put on this earth for a reason, and it's not to be tested, it's to show we can win the game. And it's like a game of chess. Funnily enough, the queen is the one you've got to protect. So why is the king the one that's got to be the sacrifice? It's been your boy, Kid Ginger Vlogs. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next vlog. Peace.